Just completed installing this two and a half inch hose for my CNC dust collection. It's imperative that I get this done. I just wanted something to overhang using my French cleat. It's gonna work well for now. If you wanna know how it's done, stick around and I'll show you how I did it. I don't really have a proper dust collection system, but I've got a shop vac and a dust stopper from Home Depot, and it's done an okay job. But I do have to fix my dust collection for the CNC. I'm gonna install a hose overhead. As I was looking at my lumber rack for my cedar fence pickets, I realized that this might be a good base. It's already French cleat, that's what I want. And as I was taking the fence pickets down, I realized how lightweight they are and how they might just fit the bill because I don't need to go out the full six feet. All I need is about 40 inches or so. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut these fence pickets, two of them to 40 inches, and we'll see what we got from there. This has got two cleats on it, so it should be plenty strong enough. I may have to fashion a way to lock it onto the first cleat system, but I think it'll be plenty strong enough. So that's the idea. I bet a four inch hose would be perfect for that. So if you're gonna be using a four inch hose, this would be perfect. You could uh, zip tie it up, drill some small holes here and zip tie it. But I'm not using a four inch hose, I'm using a two and a half inch. I could actually just rest it on zip ties. It's really not that heavy. I don't think it's gonna have any problem hanging on French cleat. Okay, that's a nice fit. Now, I'll cut a, an arc right here. Just cut the arc with the jigsaw and then rip it on the table saw. Not pretty, but it's gonna be functional. French cleats on the back. I have to move my skis. It's an adapter, I think I bought it at Home Depot, my shop vac. And if you're gonna be ordering hose, don't forget the clamp. All right. Okay, tuck it back here in the corner. Now I just have to hook up my shop vac and I'll be done. Well, thanks for sticking around. I'll be looking forward to putting this thing through its paces. I've got to surface this chessboard tomorrow, so it will definitely be tested. If this has helped you at all, please like and subscribe 